20 on the red buttons, which are part of a skeletal system. Yes. Our skeletal system has twin functions of support and protection. The average skeleton has 206 bones. Rib bones are part of our skeletal system in the axial division. Most people have 12 pairs of ribs, but about 1 in 20 is born with one or more extra pairs. The shape of bones determine the function. Long bones like the femur and the legs work like levers moving us into many positions. Our rib bones act to protect our internal organs such as the heart, lungs, liver, and stomach. Our rib bones are sometimes called a rib cage, offering protection to what's inside. Here is a picture of our internal organs inside our ribs. Right here. Oh, here's some. Mm -hmm. the back right? I don't know. <laughs> Here's the ribs inside here and stuff. Our ribs attach to the spine in the back. The upper seven pairs of ribs link directly to the sternum by the cartilage extensions. The next two or three pairs connect to the cartilages of the ribs above. The remaining floating rib do not link to the sternum. The whole rib cage is flexible because the ribs tilt. I hope you enjoyed my report on the rib bones. Any questions or comments? Yes? I have a comment. I like it how you said that they're called rib bones because I was always told that like the ribs and it's a rib cage and I never heard of the rib bones. Hmm. I have a comment. I'm glad God figured out a way to give us protection and structure without having our skeleton on the outside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like a lobster. Because you know? yeah. that makes it a lot more cozy. A lobster.